On the 11th hour of the 11th day of the 11th month, the tolling of a bell has special meaning. That's the time the armistice was signed that ended World War I. So it's particularly important today, given it's the 100th anniversary of that moment. Maryland's World War I Centennial Commission held its bell tolling ceremony at the State House. We sent 62,000 Marylanders uh, at the time to, to fight in the Great War. Uh, over 1,700 of them never returned to our state. The commission has worked toward preserving and promoting the history of Marylanders who served in World War I. None of our World War I veterans are, are, are present anymore. They've all passed on. So it's really important that we don't you know, look upon that sadly or think of them as the fallen. Um, we need to commemorate them and, and thank, thank goodness that uh, they lived to serve our country and do the tremendous things they did. In Towson, American Legion Post 22 and Elks Lodge 469 held a joint Veterans Day ceremony. to honor those who they say make the world much safer. From defending communism, fascism, and imperialism, to liberating slaves, keeping the peace during the Cold War, and battling terrorism today, veterans have accomplished remarkable things throughout our nation's history. The National World War I Commission worked for five years leading up to the centennial to commemorate American involvement in the war. Live in the studio tonight, Vanessa Herring, WBAL-TV 11 News.